Hello, good afternoon to uh, one and all. Like you, we are very much ready to go here and looking forward to a game that has been the topic for universal conversation in this part of the world for much of the last few days. It's dry at the moment, but the forecasters have warned us of impending rain. There's no certainty about that, but uh, when it does come, it shouldn't affect the uh, dynamics of a match which has so much riding on it. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture-perfect for a game of this nature. Antwerp have gone 4-3-3. Jim, how do you interpret that? Yeah, Peter, you can look at this formation one minute and think that it is 4-3-3, and the next time you check, it'll be 4-5-1. And it's all to do with whether you've got the ball or not and the wider attacking players being asked to apply defensive discipline too. When it does turn to a five across midfield, then the shape of this team takes on a much tidier, compact defensive look. And that gets things running. It'll be a throw-in. Again. Out once more. Heave to the back post. To the left it goes. She tries to get it forward quickly. He's got away. He's got loose. He's left his man. Umbakani! He's got away with one there. That's just front foot enforcement. Pressure leads to mistake, leads to chance. Umbakani. No goals as yet. Wrestled off the ball. Gets it upfield. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. It's a good run down the left hand side. out on the left now puts in a cross he's clearly asking too much with that aimed long and direct Forward it goes. Heading towards half time, and it is still scoreless. Plays it out to the wing, back into the middle. 
Danger averted for now. Could move up a gear here. And the flag has stayed down. He slid it through. And he's there to hoof it away. And it's half-time here. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. What do you think we're up to after 45 minutes? Whistle goes, and we start the second half. Antwerp playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half. Despite this scoreline, converting chances would make a world of difference for them. That's a good block, but at the expense of a corner. Oh, well played. He's taken that really cleanly. Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. You have to admire a commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing. But instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to uh, to dig in for his team here. Gets his foot in there. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Out wide to the right. Battles to win it back. And back to base. Very little to report from an attacking perspective. Jim, it's a cagey old game. Yeah, I think it's a scoreline in keeping with what we've seen up to this point. Combined attempts at goal aren't high in numbers, and we could do with something to spark this contest into life. Just brushed off the ball there. And he's... Can he put it away? And that really should have hit the net. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. And it's on Bacardi. And the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Tries to switch the play, gets it back. Antwerp. Maybe thinking about substitutions now. They still have two available. And that's been one straight back. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Chance! Going for goal! Oh, no shortage of confidence there. 
Well, the run was really impressive. The finish was depressive, and expectations were not met. Played back in, and that's left him on the seat of his pants. That's gone a long way up and away. I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. There are a few waiting for it. Nicely controlled. And it's hoisted clear. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. He's got away. Oh, that's neat. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. And there goes the final whistle. A uh, frustrating game for attackers on either side. They hardly had a sniff. Defence is broadly in charge.